The most wickedness the face of the earth, or do the face of the earth is under the name of Jesus. The woman who in a church, the grandmother, the, great, the, the mothers, them, all of them, enough of them in the churches, them are hallelujah, amen, thank you, Jesus, bless my son, cover my son under the blood, and them son are gone, man. Every song with that chain, yang, I'm in a span, yang. Hard yeah. them said it, hard ball of the road, we set the links and the code. Please remember to like, subscribe, and share, and don't forget to click the notification bell. So you get all notifications. That's better! Bless up, bless up, bless up. This is uh, Mr. Vegas, otherwise known as Subi. I posted a Bible verse from a page, saying from a Facebook page. And I see some people under the comment that say, Me must not post anything from the Bible because I mean, I believe in a God, I mean, I believe in a Jesus, and whatever, whatever. Seeing some, I am forbidden from posting anything from the Bible. Or the people who are in my, um, you know, immediate circle, them know say, me not subscribe to the Bible from a historical point of view, or from a literal point of view. Yeah, me see it as a good literature book. Yeah, so the Bible verse me post it as a Matthew ten twenty six. See, it as a fear them not therefore, for there is nothing covered that shall not be revealed and hid that shall not be known. See? So it has a basically all things must be revealed. And the Bible tells you that you know, everything must be revealed. See? So when me see certain things are revealed, right? Whether in my society or other societies or around the world, me can use a Bible verse because it's applicable. You understand? So the people will have a problem with me posting Bible verses. See? Let me ask you a question now. How much you know? Sit down and watch um, on the pastors and on the churches, them and on the leaders, them and on the evangelists, them and all of these people were using the name of Jesus, yeah, for rob people, rape people, molest children, um, commit fraud, launder money. Um, prior to that, the Europeans them use it for run them slave trade. For colonized people, Zane, the Catholic Church use the name of Jesus, um, are under the name of Jesus, modest little boys, and how many of these people them who are accountable for these actions? The slave masters them, yeah, them still have them in our history as great men, as forefathers, seeing the church leaders them were robbed the poor. Tell them lies so them can't rob God, so they must bring 10% of the money come. See? Take these people money. Don't pay taxes on the money. Um, bank the money. Use it for them own personal, um, 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 build them own personal fortunes. Yeah? Buy big house, jet cars, all of them things there, eh, and the poor people them are suffer. See? How much of them churches here are commit fraud against the people them? I tell members say, them can heal them. When them know said, no healing not happening. How much of these churches across the world, especially the black churches them, with, I tell us that they commit miracles, they create miracles, or they are perform miracles, excuse me. They perform miracles and they let people foot grow. Yeah? Them, them showing you how them letting people foot grow. And them never make a limb grow that was amputated. You never see that yet. See? So, these people who are commit fraud under the name of Jesus are in the name of Jesus. Why is it okay for them to post Bible verses and them to use the Bible? But people who don't look on the Bible from a historical point of view or a historical standpoint or a literal standpoint, why is it not okay for people like myself to see a Bible verse where applicable to things we are going and use it? Because on a desecrate the name of Jesus 24-7, you know. On a profane the name of Jesus 24-7. The most wickedness upon the face of the earth is done in the name of Jesus. Facts, hands down. Not even Satan, you know. The wickedness on the earth is not being done in the name of Satan, you know. Nobody now say, in the name of Satan, I'm going to kill you. In the name of Satan, I'm going to do this. In the name of Satan, I'm going to rob you. 
The most wickedness is upon the face of the earth. Or upon the face. Yes, so I say. So here we go on now. We are going to continue to post Bible verses when it's applicable. Yes, so I say. And no, 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 no. Cannot stop we from talking about Bible, Jesus. If we want to use Jesus' story to make a point, we are going to use Jesus' story. Because at least we now use Jesus' story or Jesus' name to rob nobody. We now get actors to come sit in wheelchair and tell them, get up in the name of Jesus. And them stand up and the whole church catch a fire and people are drop a ground and then other people see that. And things that them can stop taking medication and they can come to get healing as well. And the government is not charging these people for fraud. We are not using Jesus' name to commit fraud. We're not using Jesus' name to molest children. To rape women. So understand yourself. You see? Understand yourself. Because we would be more Jesus-like than you. Because you know better and sit in your church and watch your pastor rape little children years upon years upon years and you say nothing because you claim say he was no sin cast the first stone. You cannot even expel the people around you that are profane in the name of Jesus. Look at Pastor Lewis. If Pastor Lewis were a sinner, quote unquote by your standard of a sinner, or if he were, if he were not a pastor, you think his DNA could be found in the underwear of a child, Pastor Paul Lewis. You think his DNA could be found in the underwear of a child and in the child's vaginal cavity. An underage child, according to the scientific report that the news reported on and that the DPP reported on. You think he would not be in prison? You think if it were not for the name of Jesus, Pastor Paul Lewis would not be in prison? Understand on yourself before you start pointing finger. A wrong man or not, or the wrong person who not pointing finger on. Because if I never for the name of Jesus, no. And then people will get away with things, would not get away with it. And I believe that Pastor Paul Lewis is one of the prime examples of getting away with things under the name of Jesus. And the Catholic Church is another example. Where the priests, them, none of them not go to prison. Them pay off little boys and little boys' parents. You see? So understand on yourself. That's when I see me post my Bible verse them. Just know say me is a me is a non-believer in the foolishness where you don't believe in I want to still hold on to. Just put it that way there. See, me is a critical thinker. But the Bible, I'm a literature book. It has great stories. I'm a subscribe to some of these stories. Big up on yourself. Please remember to like. Subscribe and share and don't forget to click the notification bell so you get all notifications. That's better!